So I've lived here, I mean, over 25 years now. It's obviously known for its Caribbean community, but there's a very strong Portuguese community and French, Nigerian. What has changed in Brixton, it's just suddenly gone foodie central. We're in uh, the covered market in Brixton. Here he is, Carioca, best cakes in Brixton. Hello. Nice to see you. Nice to see you as well. Murillo and his family, you know, they're a kind of Portuguese-Brazilian family. They, they're very family orientated. They make amazing food. They're very welcoming. And there's a massive kind of Portuguese and Brazilian community in Brixton, and they're part of that community. What I quite like about living here is the culture that it brings itself, that comes from the people who live here as well. OK, so now we're just coming up into Hearn Hill and I'm going to take you to this shop here, which is called More Bleu. <laughs> How are you? And Moses, you know, grew up around here. He was a bit ahead of his time, so he was all, you know, he was all about really cool furniture. <laughs> and his taste is, like, impeccable, and it's now the kind of thing that everybody is into. And he was, you know, kind of ahead of his time, really, and so he's moved from Cold Harbour Lane to Hearn Hill and then to another shop in Hearn Hill. Can we show me around the shop? If you're going to lounge in the chair, how should you do it? Because is it comfy? Yeah, it's very He's just another person that is part of the community that offers a kind of culture to the community that I think sometimes is overlooked, but is actually the reasons why I live here. OK, so this is a proper South London secret. <laughs> this is the secret garden of Brockwell Park. And I'm not going to tell you where it is, you have to find it. <laughs> if you don't have any outside space, which we don't, um, then Brockwell Park is where you come. And I've, you know, I've lived my life in Brockwell Park, really, so pre-kids and after kids. It serves everybody, and everybody comes here all the time. I really love it, you know, I really appreciate it, because urban living is what I want to do. I like living in town, but it's really nice to have a a space that's as peaceful and as beautiful as this that you can just visit, you know. And it's not what Brixton's known for, and so I just wanted to show that Brixton's got a nice kind of Hampstead Heathy bit as well, you know. Mm -hmm.